I'm going to use a mat. Are you ready for this mat? Are you guys ready? We're going to make cinnamon rolls after that. That is what I'll use. I'm going to give this a good mix. As you can see, it's melting into the cinnamon. hi guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel in case you are new here hi my name is Martha Kare and to all my returning subscribers thank you so much for coming back so i'm actually stepping out yeah i'm heading to church because it's on a sunday and i decided to start the vlog today in the morning so i want to submit my ootd which i'll do by inserting a picture or a video over here because you know i cannot like the way we set the the sorry the camera for youtube you, you can't capture like the whole fit yep so i'm just going to insert a picture over here but for the little details of my ootd i have my bag which is blue i've also done a make makeup and this is I don't know if it's, this is rushed orange or burnt orange yeah burnt orange and blue heel so yeah so i'll submit my otd by posting it over here so let me head out to church guys and then i'll talk to you after church bye bye see you then seeing something over here like yeah like there's like a stuff over here i guess it's because you know my phone screen broke so i guess that's why it's behaving like that so hello guys so i just got home and as you know if you live alone you know this rule immediately you get to the house just wash your hands and head to the kitchen if you want to cook otherwise you'll end up sleeping hungry or skipping room or, or skipping having dinner so i will really quickly mugali it's the time that I'm getting home. It's around 7.30. So I want to make ugali. I have some leftover beef and managu. That is what I'll be accompanying it with. I also want to show you guys a recipe of my overnight soaked oats. Then after that, I'll freshen up and then we'll watch a few vlogs. And then we'll call it a day. I don't think there's anything else that... Anything, anything. Hey, 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 hey. I don't think there's anything else that I'm going to do today. Yep, and then we'll call it a day. But first, as my water is boiling, let me show you how to prepare the overnight soaked oats. This is everything that you need for this recipe. I have my oats. I'm using this, the oat mix. I also have chia seeds. Focus. I'm going to use some chia seeds. And since I don't have honey, I'm going to use yogurt, vanilla yogurt. But if you have Greek yogurt, the better and i'm going to use milk this is fat free milk yeah so that is what i'm going to do so i'm going to add everything here in the in this bowl then i'm going to use a clean film to cover like like to cover everything and let it stay in the fridge overnight and then i'm going to enjoy it tomorrow so i'm going to add my toppings tomorrow in the morning you can either add strawberries or banana anything that you feel it's comfortable for you so i'm just going to mix everything here yep <laughs>
guys so i just got home and i've just put my bag and started vlogging because i know if i don't do this right now i'll end up postponing the whole thing up to who knows when so i want to show you some of the stuff that i got today if you have watched my other video then you know what i'm talking about um i talked about transforming my house so i'm really trying to like buy stuff or change some of the things that i've been using yep an upgrade because the girl is upgrading anyway <laughs> so i want to do an upgrade for the house and there's some stuff that i have bought lately and actually the good thing is today i passed by think twice and i was lucky to get some of the stuff we got good stuff at an affordable price today the highest price was 130 can you imagine that from textile to clothes and everything and i was lucky to get a few stuff let me show you first the things that i got today and then i'm going to get the rest from the bedroom while i take my tripod stand i have some of the stuffs here that allow me to just do this haul very quickly as i plug you because this is what i do best I, so i guess i'll start with the the thrift stuff that i got from think twice today and the first thing is this you know these pillows they are usually put on like the extra pillows that are used for decorating the bed this one i got at 100 kenyan shillings so i also got ozzy um a sleeping mattress Damn. then the last thing that i got from thing twice is um this this is how it's looking like it's a uh, grayish in color it's grayish in color it's a throw blanket are you ready for this mat are you guys ready for this mat because you can't imagine that they are thrift like they are so so new Ta -da! look at that i mean guys just look at this i got this at 350 kenyan shillings and the other mat are you ready for this go is this i mean just let guys let me before I plug you, let me just show you this stuff. Huh? This one was going for 600 Kenyan shoes. You see, the, if you are in Akuru, there is stage mat chap chap opposite stage mat chap. There, there, there are the men who usually sell shoes there. Like, they are down there. So, the first stall is on this other side is a bag. Then, the next stall, there's a guy who sells their curtains, like quality thrift textile like curtains carpets mats all those stuff so that is where i got this and he, he has a variety of them so one this is a parcel that i got from a shop from instagram it's called 254 sunshine collection i'm going to insert their handle over here first thing that i got is a towel a white towel it's very good it's very big can you see how white it is it's very very white and it's big quality and a high absorbent material the other thing that i got from them is um a set of sheets set of sheets it came like this so if it's uh the set includes two sets of blood sheets and four four pillowcases have you ever had somewhere like that even the duvet they usually sell it with only two pillowcases but this one comes with two flat sheets and four pillowcases just woken up today is on a saturday and i want to do cleaning that's why you have seen it like i've left my bed like that i want to do cleaning but first i'll have to like freshen up a bit that is washing my face i'm not going to do my facial at this point and um also brush my teeth and make breakfast so that before i start cleaning i need to have breakfast because i'm really really hungry yesterday i didn't make dinner I guess that's why so that's what i want to do plus i also want to change my pajamas because i can't like do laundry in this 
I kept manifesting a washing machine. I hate doing laundry for Christ's sake. I don't love doing laundry. Give me anything else, but not me doing laundry. So I want to fix myself breakfast. It's not something fancy. It's just bread and tea. Then after that, I'll do cleaning. I'm not going to show you all of that. We are going to make cinnamon rolls after that. That is what I'll use to close up the vlog. Yeah, because nowadays I don't like my videos to be like too long, past 15 minutes. That's why. So yeah, guys, let me see you after cleaning because I'm not going to film the other parts. Yep, so see you. We need one clean bowl. Then in the bowl, we're going to add one cup of warm milk I'm going to one sachet of instant yeast sugar pinch of salt melted butter one egg so I'm going to give this a good mix then we'll add the flour and at this point I'm going to use my hands to knead Guys, this is after five minutes of kneading. And as you can see, the dough is a little bit sticky. But when I put like a clean finger or hand, it's not sticking to it. So this is the right consistency. So I'm just going to cover this using a clean flame. Then I'll leave it to, 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 to rest until it doubles in size. So guys, this is after around 30 to 45 minutes. Then I'm going to punch out the air. Ooh. I'm going to dust my working surface with a little bit of flour. And I'm just going to transfer this here and roll it out. So guys, you're supposed to end up with something like this. Next thing that I am going to do is spread butter. The African butter that is but you have butter that you like so I'm going to like spread it. I'm going to do is for this mixture. This is a mixture of brown sugar. I I've added, I've added just a little bit of white sugar so that it can it was sticking together. So I guess it has helped. And then with cinnamon. So this is the spread. So I'm just going to spread it on the dough. to make the frosting and this is what i'm using it's the pristine whipping cream that we are almost done so as you can see they're very very soft let me show you see they're not hard just make sure to use like the correct measurements that i have told you and you'll achieve the same result so i'm going to let them like cool a bit just become warm and then you're going to apply the frosting so that it can melt into the into the cinnamon rolls so guys this is the outcome after putting on the frosting so like as you can see it's melting into the cinnamon rolls yep so that's it for this week's video i hope you've enjoyed make sure to share like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified anytime i upload a video until next time bye